what's up my youtube people welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here karibu sana <laughs> i share content about au pairing and au pairing in luxembourg and everywhere in europe so today i'm coming in with a video about some of the countries that may interest you that you need to au pair in and uh, this will actually help uh, your journey easier for looking for families and the host families and let's get down to it uh yeah this video is so awkward because i am standing <laughs> i am standing because uh it's very boring just to sit down every day talking to the camera blah 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 people might click out of the video because it's not exciting but i said let me stand so that to quite engaged number one number one on the list i'm going to provide you with 10 countries based on how easy it is to apply to become an au pair most of these countries have their own au pair visa so it's very easy uh, compared to the countries which you need only um, student visa blah 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 which complicates the issue kind of yeah so i'm very terrible in setting up my camera if i look like i'm tilted whatever man as long as the point gets home <laughs> number one and top one on the list is luxembourg i advocate for this country because it's very easy to apply to its uh visa and everything and this is where i'm appearing in and yeah this means you can ask me anything about appearing in luxembourg and every process uh, for the um i will be categorizing these countries under the age requirement the language requirement visa processing and some fact fun facts and the pocket money payment and some of these things change over time i've written on the title 2024 which i believe is the updated uh requirements it can change over time do not come for me if the if the information is wrong sometimes they just wake up in the morning and they tell you oh no the age has changed to 30 to 26 so bear with me if that changes this information i was getting from friends who are also appearing around europe so some of them are comfortable enough to tell me the truth some of them are lying about the pocket money they are being paid but you can always find this information everywhere on the internet if you're a google uh, master <laughs> anyway for luxembourg the age requirement is 18 years to 30 years which is a plus for people who are already above 25 do they need any language or any certificates for you to present at the embassy no no you do not need any language any certificates for language all you need is your english and your high school uh, certificate that is it that is it uh the current au pair pocket money being paid in luxembourg is 514 euros about luxembourg it's a small country although there's a vibe because it's it's in between three other countries which is namely france german and belgium so on your free au pair time you can always go around with the intercity buses intercity trains you can travel all around europe however way you like it and yes transport is free as i always say so if you are willing come to luxembourg for those asking uh which embassy do we apply in uh there's no luxembourg embassy but you use something called the tls contact which is online for booking your appointments they deal with the german uk and belgium visas and once they take your documents from the tls they will submit it to the belgium embassy so yes do choose luxembourg as your number one country to appear in <laughs> Nakaka mwenye nimelipwa ku promote Luxembourg. Oh yeah yeah yeah. People have been telling me stop speaking in Swahili. Number 2 on the list is definitely Germany. Germany. Woo! Germany the age requirement as of now is 18 years to 26 years. As at the time of application you should be 26. If you are waiting to turn 27 and your application is not yet received, oh sorry. Mind you, Germany uh, stands at the most host families around there in the internet. If you just wake up today and you want to find a family, you'll probably meet so many German families. So stop complaining, oh, I'm not finding a host family. There are so many host families in Germany. So many demand. There's so much demand. The thing is, though, there's a but. You have to have a German A1 certificate language, language certificate from the Gotti Institute of education back in all your countries they only um 
they only recognize a certificate certificate from Gote Institute. Anything less above just a certificate from Gote Institute from A1 that shows that you've passed with above 60 points, which I think is where the Kizungumkuti in a tokea. Plus, uh, as at now, for me, I experienced, uh, I had a German family and I experienced the, the, the getting of uh, appointments from the embassy of German embassy. Wow. <laughs> Don't ask me how people do it. I do not know until today how people get the embassy appointment. But if you get a German family, all the best. All the best. <laughs> German as at now, they pay their au pairs a pocket money of 280 euros. 290 euros. Ah, personally, I think it's the lowest. And wow, it's, it's a lot. Compared to the things you're doing as an au pair. 280 is a bit... Germany, can you please try and uh, do something about it? Number three, number three, France. France. France is a very nice country, a big country. You don't the French speakers. It has the Eiffel Tower in Paris. If you're that person wants to travel and go to Paris, you know, and take pictures in the Eiffel Tower, definitely choose France as your au pair place. They take au pairs from the age of 18 up to 30 years wow so nobody is left out for now they do not need any language course no languages needed just like luxembourg you can go to the embassy without proving that you've learned any language you will learn it once you get there for now they are paying their au pairs 320 euros i am not sure the person telling me this one was not sure also so i think it's 320 euros um I can even give you the requirements at the embassy, a contact letter from the host family, a contact letter, an invitation letter, insurance proof. They can do a cheaper one for three months just in case, in case you don't get your, your, your visa. Language enrollment letter from the country, an ID or a passport photocopy from your host family. From you as an au pair, you need a good conduct, a motiv motivation letter, a gapless CV. You don't have gaps. KCAC, of course. And then a flight itinerary, you know, that you've already booked. And this will help you get a visa very quickly. Just get the documents. With the embassy, just get the documents. Stop saying, oh, I was denied a visa, blah, blah, blah. And you will be on your way to au pair in France. Number four, Norway. Norway, the beautiful country, the beautiful, beautiful country of Norway. As for Norway, they take au pairs up to 18 years to 30 years. Really nice, really nice. No language course needed. Just go with your English. Even at the embassy, you do not need any paper to prove that you've learned any language. For their pocket money, they are paying 569 euros. Wow! That is so that is a lot, guys. That trust me. You are even pesa mingi, guys. And um for Norway, you'll find they have natural landscapes. They have the polar bears. I don't know if you can see them or it's just during the winter. <laughs> Some say you can be able to see um, the northern lights from Norway. Also, this is where the Vikings became kings, blah, blah, blah. And yeah, the sun sometimes does not set in summer. Ha! Fun fact about Norway. So if you really want to go go uh au pair in norway definitely choose this as your as your next au pair <laughs> as your next country to au pair in number five sweden or in german we call it sweden <laughs> their ages are 18 to 30. they have no language requirement whatsoever if you want to go to sweden just go with your english then you'll you learn what whichever language you want to learn they pay they, they pay their au pairs a pocket money of 450 euros i'm yet to confirm that but as at now it's 450 euros fun fact about sweden they say they have they sometimes built an hotel made totally out of ice hmm is this is this remotely possible i do not know uh the game this minecraft the one uh the gen z play it was invented in sweden imagine that and then um uh, some of the good artists my favorite actually the swedish dj called avici was from 
Sweden. Yay! But he's dead. But also Abba for millennials, you know Abba. So come on, you forget, forget I said this, but they're all from Sweden. So kudos to Sweden. If you want to appear there, definitely choose Sweden. Number six, Denmark. Oh, Denmark. Talk about Denmark. Actually, all these uh, countries I'm mentioning are all around inside Europe. So Europe is very easy because they don't speak English. So for us, it's very nice to exchange the language because we speak English. They don't. They need us for English. Kudos. So Denmark, for now, they take ages 18 to 29. Not 30, 29, okay? So once you turn 30, sadly, no, you cannot appear in Denmark. Uh, they pay their pocket money of 4,554 Danish krona. Danish krona is their money, which if you convert to euros, it becomes 611. 611, that's good money. And yeah, sadly, Denmark is very cold. Towards Copenhagen, it gets colder. <laughs> the winter is so cold, but it's not bad. You can... You can experience cold in your own way you know and uh, denmark is said to be the flattest place on earth i don't know these are just google facts <laughs> as in there's no mountains what do you mean <laughs> anyway yeah those are just some of the facts number seven coming up hi is belgium belgium so Belgium, they take ages 18 to 25. Oh no, so 25 is a very bit, it's a bit low, but if you want to do this, start in your early ages so you can able to, you can be able to travel in there, in Belgium. For me, I'm doing this because Belgium is neighboring Luxembourg. So yeah, <laughs> they pay a pocket money of 450 euros. Not bad, not bad at all for an au pair. Uh, fun facts about Belgium. Yeah, they produce the sweetest beer. I've never tasted, but every time I go to the pubs here and you read at the bottom of the beer, so many beers are from Belgium. So kudos to Belgium if they are producing the best beers. Also, they are, you know, the signal, the symbol, like ours, the way it's a cock. Theirs is a boy peeing. Huh? How? <laughs> And, and they say that the drinking age there is 16. So once you get to 16, you're allowed to drink. Hmm. Ah, okay, if you want to drink at 16, definitely go to Belgium. Another country, country number eight is the Netherlands. Netherlands. Netherlands, you can, um, you can appear in Netherlands at the age of 18 to 25. So it's actually limited. You need to be 18 to 25 years of age to appear in Netherlands. And they only pay... 340 euros 340 euros i do not know if it changes changes but it's 340 euros uh netherlands is known for amsterdam which is the party is the center of all parties used to be called holland but now they prefer it as netherlands and these people they like to ride bikes they actually have uh, <laughs> a truck just painted for the bicycle so you buy a car you pack it at home you start driving you, you start cycling you know which is it's amazing and there wajakoya is it's legal actually you just walk in the coffee shop you're like yo give me some they give you the menu you choose you walk away how great is that okay for children don't don't follow what i'm saying <laughs> Number nine, number nine, last but not least, Finland. Finland, great, great, great country. I love this country. You can appear from the age of 18 to 29 years. So that's good. That's not bad. They pay their au pairs uh, pocket money of 280 euros, just like Germany. Do you need a language? No, you don't need language courses. You do not need language courses at all. You just go to the embassy. You say, mm, I'll learn my language once I get there. And yeah, you get a visa for Finland. Number last, number 10 is Austria or Vienna. I know they kind of separate it, but for me, I'll put them together, Austria and Vienna. So Austria, they require you to be 18 to 30 years of age. I do not, I'm not sure about this age. I used to think it's 18 to 25, but uh, somebody is communicating to me that it's 18 to 30 years of age. Let me know if you are appearing there. Let me know if it's 30 or 25 years, but for now, I think it's 30 years. You definitely need a language, which is Germany A1, uh, also from Goethe. 
Uh, so the two countries which you need a, a language certificate is German and Austria. Take note, all these other countries you don't need a certificate, okay? So here they pay you pocket money of 591 euros. So nice. So fun facts about Austria, about Vienna, I did not Google. But but you can google and save me these things so yeah there is um ninacare.com which uh is an app which uh just uh, they look they only give families in netherlands so all you need to do is pass an interview with them you and the host family need to pass an interview with ninacare.com which will enable you to get their help they are an agency you do not need to pay, but they will assist you in, uh, in, 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 in the travel arrangements, visa arrangements, which sometimes can be cumbersome and very expensive, which most of us never have that money, you know. So definitely try Nina, ninacare.com. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Nani care or Nina care? Nina care. Woo! Uh, yeah, and for Netherlands, it's Nina care and Sunshine Agency. Sunshine Agency and Nina care okay i will link them down in the description box uh other uh sites which you can find or find a host family because people are, people have been asking me oh opair.com is not working opair world is also not working for netherlands and if you are 25 years and below you can try those two for other places there's www.opair butterfly i will I will spell it here or link them in the description which you need to pay but i don't feel like it's bad to invest in this you can invest in this and then go and then www.aufini.com and the last one greatopair.com www.greatopair.com that one you don't know you do not need to pay just the aufini and opera butterfly yeah and you'll find a family and be on your way to whichever country you want to go I will definitely update for other countries, which there are so many countries. I'm not saying that these are the only countries you can appear in. I'm just uh, uh, suggesting these ones because they are very popular and so many families are from here. But there's still Italy, there's Spain, there's so many other countries. There's Ireland. If you're willing to, to get a student uh, visa to go to other or all those countries, Switzerland, there's so many countries. Then definitely do that. I cannot stop you. So um praying for all of you au pairs out there and the upcoming au pairs i am praying for all your journeys and contact me when you get here so bye